Now, ladies and gentlemen, we've now come to the segment where you decide what we are going to talk about. And that is through the questions and answers segment. What is the difference between a data analyst and a data scientist? A data analyst is someone who would do data visualizations, who would analyze the data. Typically, they will just provide insights. Data analysts, the types of skills, especially for programming, is not as wide and as broad. A data analyst will typically sometimes only use Excel or, or use one statistical software. For the data scientist, it's much more. Firstly, it's going to have to start with a business problem. Secondly, for a data scientist, you would need a combination of skills, whereas a data scientist is actually expected to be able to program. They would need to be able to use Python to come up with solutions. Then they will do the data analyst role. They will definitely analyze and find insights. They will build the models like the analysts. They have to solve the problem. So they have to make the recommendations and they also need to demonstrate the value or the impact of the solution. Laura would like to check on the prerequisites to admissions to the Master of Science in Industry 4.0. Um, she would like to know if she could apply for the Master of Science in Industry 4.0 this semester. And if not, could we share with her, you know, what are her options at this point in time? Yes, you can apply. Okay, you have a bachelor's degree, even though it's not in the field of uh, science, engineering, uh, analytics, but you are taking a certificate in foundations uh, in computing. So that will definitely be taken into consideration. Uh, of course, just obtaining the certificate is not everything. Uh, we will also look at the GPA you have attained. So yes, please submit your application so that we can review it. Okay, one of the prerequisites for the Master of Science in Industry 4.0 program is to have a basic knowledge of programming. How do we assess this? So basically, if you have done programming courses, uh, you can actually submit certification to us. And if you do not have any certification and during your undergraduate studies, you did not take any course on programming as well, then you will be recommended to complete at least uh, one or two courses online. So after completion, you will be asked to provide the certificate to us. What are the advantages of um, a multidisciplinary program like the MSc in uh, Industry 4.0 as compared to other more specific and specialized programs? Um, so multidisciplinary, of course, then you just have uh, a much bigger choice because these same programs, these same master's programs, you can choose your modules from. So it just gives you more flexibility. For professionals in different fields, what would one's advice be for self-studying data science and analytics, I would believe? Firstly, you would have to start with some sort of programming knowledge. So there are some good programming, data camp, for example, you get a, a few online courses that can help you at least to get started in your programming knowledge. Because when you go for the course, it's an expectation that you can already do programming. Second, I would always do the data science study in a way that, you know, you got to ask questions. Don't be shy to ask questions because that's where the learning takes place. Most of the information will never just come from one source. Even when you're in a certain program, you always have to venture out and gather a lot more information to improve capabilities. Uh, I would also say that, again, working teams as well, so definitely different solutions, different ideas come at play. And so that your solution that you put through, it's been well thought of because it's been debated within your team, discussed, and I would say more innovative solutions or more accurate solutions can come out. For those of you who are interested in the Master of Science in Industry 4.0 graduate degree program, the closing date for applications are 15 of March 2021. If you're interested, you know, hit us up via email and we'll get back to you and share as much information as we can. Have a great weekend, y'all.